Yes. Mm -hmm. uh, Moses stretched forth his rod over the land of Egypt, and the Lord brought an east wind upon the land all that day. Mm -hmm. Then it brought the locusts. Mm. The locusts went up over the land of Egypt. Mm. And then uh, covered the face of the whole earth. Oh. Then Pharaoh called for Moses and Aaron and hastened. He said, I have sinned against the Lord your God and against you. Mm -hmm. Now, therefore, forgive, I pray thee, my sin only this once, and entreat the Lord your God that he may take away from me this death. <laughs> and he went out from Pharaoh and entreated the Lord. But the Lord hardened Pharaoh's heart. Now, um, this hardening of the heart of those in law enforcement, mm -hmm. why don't you not do anything today? You'll find me in a homeless shelter making videos and emailing those that are liable for child abuse. You've been hardening your hearts against the laws of the United States and you refuse to support. And then somebody's going to be the total fucking idiot and decide to kill children because they're seven months gestation mm -hmm. instead of six. Pooch. See, we keep getting farther and farther away. Now, I don't care if you're Jewish, Christian, mm -hmm, Indian, or any other fucking religion. All you're doing is making excuses of why you have the right to kill a child. Pow. Now, why don't we take it back to partial birth abortion because of medical reasons or a crime rape? Yeah. And then why don't we take it back to the three months where that's when the heartbeat starts in the brain? Yeah. And then why don't we leave abortion alone right now, Governor? Because you decided to harden your heart. You don't like lawsuits, and you know I have the right to sue you. You refuse to enforce the law because you won't go to prison. And it's time for you to confess the knowledge that you have of fraud, forgery, conspiracy, child abduction, child kidnapping, and child abuse. Now, if Governor Andrew can... Why don't you shut the fuck up about it? <laughs>